Hey everyone, welcome back to The Rocketeer. Today I want to talk about a couple of subjects that end up in the comment section quite often. The first one is carol syrup or corn syrup. What is it and how is it useful in making rocket propellant? And the second topic is our candy. It's cheap, easy to make, so why don't I recommend it? But before we get to that, I want to share with you something. In the last video, I asked everyone that lived outside of the United States to leave a comment and tell me your country of origin. And wow, I was really surprised by the response. I got responses from all over the world. So I want to share that map with you. But one thing to keep in mind is what this teaches us is that rocketry is popular all across the planet. So check out this map and then we'll get to the video. Our candy. If you have been on the internet and looking for tutorials on how to make propellant, you probably have seen a few of these uh, tutorials on our candy. Most of them are very old. And uh, one of the reasons why I don't recommend our candy, there are several, but one of them is because simply there are better materials to use. Better materials that we have available today. Materials that don't require as much heat, that are easier to work with, and that don't burn quite as fast. That is one of the problems with our candy. It burns too fast. So why is that a problem? Well, it can overpressurize extremely easily and it burns a lot faster than the rest of the propellants available today. That is not exactly what I would call a benefit. Not only that, our candy is extremely brittle. Uh, it, tends, it can tend to crack during the burn and uh, it's just uh, not a material that's recommended anymore. So. I know some of you are probably still using our candy. Uh, I just like to take an opportunity for you to check out the channel. Look at some of my videos on different materials I use like sorbitol or flex fuel or something like that. And in the future, I'll be showing more of these videos. So let's get to the next topic. What is carol or corn syrup? It is a thick syrupy sweet liquid that's made out of corn, wheat, potatoes, uh, a number of things. It goes by a lot of different names. It's used in baked goods like pecan pie, candy, chocolate, muffins, things like that. It gives these materials, these foods, uh, a smooth texture and it retains moisture. So why do we use it in rocket fuel? It keeps your propellant from becoming brittle. Just like it makes the muffins and candy soft and retains a little bit of moisture, it also does the same thing to the propellant, allowing it to be pliable. Also, it takes a lot less heat to melt a propellant because the sugars are actually melted into the carol syrup or glucose or corn syrup, whatever you want to call it. And that allows us to use a lot lower temperatures. It also allows the sugar to flow into the casting tubes much easier. So there are many advantages to using flex fuel. If you don't have corn syrup available in your particular area, you can always make it. If you do an internet search, you can find out different ways to make corn syrup from sucrose using things like lemon juice and a few other materials that helps break it down into glucose and fructose. So you can also use uh, sorbitol. It works very well, uh, it has similar properties. I use 25% sorbitol uh, as a replacement for the sucrose and that seems to work pretty well too. So I hope you found this video helpful. Uh, leave me a like, a comment, uh, make sure you subscribe so you can keep up on future videos. Until then, stay well, stay healthy. I'll see you soon.